Welcome back, and thanks for tuning in to episode 50 of Lab Padres, SpaceX, and Starbase Weekly Updates. I'm Lewis, your host. Now let's dig in. After finishing Booster 7's static fire the day before, the Orbital Launch Integration Tower's chopsticks were lowered down to the base on Friday. After several months of work at the build site, Starship 26, an unusual vehicle that's been made without tiles or flaps, made its way out of the high bay and onto Highway 4 before setting off for the launch site on Saturday. On Sunday morning, Ship 26 was placed onto Test Stand A, where the currently engineless ship will undergo cryogenic proof testing ahead of its final outfitting. Built as a prototype orbital propellant depot, Ship 26 will demonstrate orbital refueling capabilities, which is on the critical path for NASA's human landing system. Starship 27's forward dome, mostly complete and outfitted with most of its plumbing, was relocated to the high bay for stacking on Monday. Late Tuesday evening, the recently fabricated nose cone test article was rolled onto Highway 4 and relocated to the Sanchez site. Meanwhile, Ship 27's nose cone and payload bay were stacked onto the forward dome section inside the high bay. A hovercraft was spotted, which is used to quickly ferry SpaceX employees between Starbase and South Padre Island. Over at the Cape, Crosby Skipper returned to port with Just Read the Instructions and Booster 1073 after the Amazonas Nexus mission on Friday. After docking at the wharf, the booster was lifted onto the dock for leg stowage ahead of rollback to Hangar X at Roberts Road. Early on Sunday morning, Falcon 9 Booster 1062 took off in its 12th mission, launching Starlink Group 5-4 into low Earth orbit. Bob Toad just read the instructions out to sea later that morning for the Inmarisat 6F2 mission, which would lift off on Friday. On Wednesday evening, Doug returned to port with two fairing halves on board, towing a shortfall of Gravitas with Booster 1062 on the deck. By Thursday morning, Falcon 9 Booster 1062 was back on the docks and beginning preparations for refurbishment ahead of its next flight. And there you have it, another SpaceX and Starbase weekly update brought to you by Lab Padre. We'll see you next week and thanks for watching. Lab Padre out.